When you drink, alcohol passes through the placenta, the organ that nourishes your baby and helps him or her to grow. Any woman can have a baby who's affected by alcohol. And it's alcohol, it's not the type of alcohol. Any type of alcohol can damage the baby. Exposure to alcohol can cause long-term harm and in extreme cases can even result in a miscarriage or stillbirth. Most of the babies are born three or four weeks premature if they're affected by alcohol and even that amount of prematurity can lead to some complications. But the, lo the biggest problem, certainly from the children's point of view but also from the family's point of view, is long-term brain damage. We don't know what levels are safe and which levels are harmful and therefore we encourage all mums to not drink at all. When there's no alcohol, then there's no risk. Being exposed to alcohol in pregnancy can cause damage to babies' brains and is associated with what's known as fetal alcohol spectrum disorders. In the most serious cases, the baby's physical features and growth can also be affected and this is called Fetal Alcohol Syndrome, or FAS. Fetal Alcohol Syndrome is thought to be the severe end of um, fetal alcohol spectrum disorder. And in Fetal Alcohol Syndrome, you can actually see that the baby's been affected. That damage occurs if women drink between 8 and 12 weeks of pregnancy. If women go on drinking later in their pregnancy, when the baby's brain is still developing, this can lead to learning difficulties with language, communication and behavioural problems. If you're thinking of becoming pregnant or find out you are pregnant and realise you have a problem with alcohol, it's important you seek help from your GP or midwife. If you have an issue with alcohol consumption and you find that you're pregnant, the first thing that you need to do is to tell someone. And I would encourage any mum to tell their midwife or to tell their GP so that they can be referred for the right help. And since you've become pregnant, how much have you been drinking? Um, a bit less, but still still something most, most days, I'd okay. say. Mums may not want to tell me that they have problems with alcohol in their pregnancy, because firstly, as a new mum, you may not realise that drinking alcohol in pregnancy is a problem, and therefore not understand that that's something you need to tell me about. Um, they might feel that midwives or GPs are going to judge them for having an alcohol problem and being pregnant. They may feel that they're going to have their children taken away from them or when actually what we want to do is to support them through their pregnancy and to refer them to the right people to help them to stop.